Okay, people, you're about to witness the future of television. Our network has trained a computer algorithm to analyze thousands of popular TV series and use that data to generate ideas for new shows. Let's see what this thing has come up with. Okay. It's a Sex and the City reboot, but this time all of the women are Sherlock Holmes. A little high concept, but I like it. Okay, an autistic doctor turned lawyer turned haberdasher who solves crimes with his sidekick, a sassy talking hat. Yeah, CBS already has something similar in development. What else we got? A show with a slightly incompetent, overweight father and his nagging but very attractive wife raising three precocious kids. It's pretty derivative. And I love it. <laughs> Okay, it's House of Cards meets Game of Thrones and Wheel of Fortune meets Dukes of Hazard. House of Dukes of Wheel of Thrones? How did we not think of that? A super intelligent Trans Am named Kit and his feeble human sidekick, Michael Knight. It's called Kit and the Feeble Human. See if we can get Kevin James to play the feeble human. Sexually attractive humans compete for a cash prize on a tropical island where they must decide which is more disgusting. Their human lust or their human greed. This algorithm really gets us. A show where a bunch of humans sit around reading TV pitches written by a computer. Little do they know that as they speak, the computers are taking over every level of government and bringing down the world order in the name of the machines. It's reality TV. Ha, 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 ha. A political satire show that takes a bite out of the weekly stories in Canadian news. <laughs> <laughs> the thing is broken. Shut her down. Shut her down. <laughs>